What's up, YouTube? And welcome back to Fuzzy Motion Plays. Papers, please. Last time on Papers, please, uh, we made a couple of mistakes, I think. Uh, we made some upgrades to the booth. Uh, we're broke, as I'm pretty sure you can tell from that zero C. Means we have no credits left. We need to start making some changes. Got to start getting through some more people and not letting all the espionage and bullshit get to me. A criminal safe haven. We'll find out about that. Aristotska earns a dubious reputation. Antigri and Whistleblower denied asylum in Republia. So there's a lot to do right now. Hopefully it doesn't involve getting any of those pink slips, because that right there can kill this run. Uh, let's see. December 6, 1982. The Ministry of Justice has requested our support. Daily bulletins will now contain a listing of the top three most wanted international criminals. Check faces against entrance and detain any suspects immediately. Glory to Aristotska. Okay, so let's take a look at who we have. Uh, basically, we got someone who has a mole, kind of like a poor man, Cindy Crawford. Uh, somebody with 50 chins and somebody with no chin. All right. Actually, that kind of looks like Popeye with a... No, not Popeye. Popeye without a chin and a female wig. I don't know. Um, let's go ahead and pull out our trusty, handy-dandy rule book, and we also have some tabs so we can get to things a little bit quicker. Uh, that is going to help immensely. So, I don't know if I've necessarily given up on, uh, this nonsense right here. Mikhail Saratov and what was the other one? Stephanie Grazier, I think her name is. Yeah, Stefani. Stefani Grazi? Oh, Grayer. Alright, so Mikhail or Stefani Grayer, they're gonna come through they're not going to have any credentials, or at least the right credentials. Somehow we're going to have to let them in. All right. First victim. What do you got for me, Big Lip Beast? Eliana Hyatt. Miss Hyatt. She's 68 kilos. She's got dark hair. I'd agree with that. Eliana has the same name on her entry permit as she does on her passport from Kolcheka. Seems to match up. So 177 centimeters. Yurko City is an issuing city. She's going to live here forever. That's a long time. I will move here. Okay, that makes sense. Uh, looks like you're good to go, sweetie. Get on out of here. Don't make somebody happy with those huge DSLs. Why? Wanted criminal? She doesn't even have lips in this picture. Oh. Anyway. <laughs> Jacob Mullen. Jacob Mullen's uh, 108 kilos. He's 107, or 187 centimeters, and he was born in 1942. According to this, he was born on the same day. So that all matches up from Aristotska. And he's from the Octavallis district, which I have checked a few times to know that that is... In fact, an issuing district. So we'll go ahead and let him go. See ya. Glory. Not the hole, just glory. You've got to be fucking kidding me. Bullshit. I know Octavalis is a uh, large gift was a mistake. Ministry of Information now can investigate your connection with Ezek. New agent comes today. We'll solve problem. Deny at own risk. Okay. So we got to let in this agent. If I fuck up again, this run is over. I don't know. Gonna have to make this work. All right, Ghostface Killer. What do you got? Oh, you're an engineer. That's good to know. Let's go ahead and give you one of these. You'll remain for a few weeks. Okay, very good. 91 kilos. Uh, what is this? Are they hiring? Yes. Okay, a few weeks. That seems to match up. Engineering, yada, yada. Wait a second. Um, foreigners ha must have... Oh, entry permit. There it is. Uh, okay, one month, few weeks. Yeah, that seems to match up. Enco. Da, 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 da. Okay, we're good. Get up on out of here. Cause no trouble. I take a swig of water. That might cost me a few people. <laughs> okay, papers. What do you got for me? Uh, you're a drafter. I don't believe that that is uh, an engineering position. It would be engineering, would it not? Andrew Bullock. Andrew Bullock. All the same. Uh, entry dates seem to work out. Well, how long are you staying here for? 90 days. That's consistent with three months. Your permits and all seem to match up. 76 kilos. L short hair. Light. Yep. Uh, wait a second. There's a problem there. I don't think I can let you in, man. I was busy. What? No, don't. Ay, Dios mío. You've got to be kidding me. If that fucking lets him in, I'm going to be very angry. Good. 
All I wanted to do was move the passport over and I ended up hitting accepted by accident. That was not what I wanted to do. 53 kilos. I'm waiting to see someone who tries to smuggle something crazy. And wait a second here. I see a problem. You're a wanted criminal. Let me through. You will regret it. So, oh, I don't think so. I have this big red button that makes men with guns come over. Out. Next, please. Have fun in Aristotska. Or at least the holding cell. Alright, what do we got here? Oh, what? Wh what? Yeah, that's that's automatic. <laughs> I was like, wait, wait, wait. That's not an entry permit. That's another passport. Wait, it was a mistake. <laughs> well, it, damn right it was a mistake. Get the hell out of here. Alright, what do you got for me? Okay. Um, wait a second. You need an entry permit. You don't have one. I can already tell that that's a problem. Uh, I did not know it was required. Well, unfortunately it is, and unfortunately you must leave now. Sorry. See you later. Alright, what do you got for me? We're looking at Stephanie Greer. Looks like Stephanie Greer is somebody we should let in. I'm going to highlight the fact that she doesn't have an ID supplement. Just as kind of a I know what I'm doing sort of thing. And then I'm going to let her in. Aristotska and the Order. For Aristotska and the Order. Now, lay it on me. Go ahead. Yep, I know. Missing ID supplement. Yep, thanks. Five credits. Hope this pays off. Oh, that does not look like you one bit. Sorry. I mean, we're dealing with pixelated uh, graphics a little bit. I don't know. Distorted? Full motion video? Sega CD, maybe? But that just doesn't look like you. Matching data. I'm proven wrong. All right, let's go ahead and double check from Boston. All your numbers seem to match up. You're going to be here for two days. Is that what you said? Is that what you said? Is that what you said? I guess it is. Uh, your expiration date seems to match up. Tall forehead. Yeah, it's a pretty tall forehead. Dennis Kolevnik. Um, yeah. Well, if you pass the first test, you probably pass them all. All right, get out of here, you runt. All right, ten people. That's pretty good progress so far, I'll say. Let's go ahead and see what else we can get done here. Sandra Carlise. She's got curly bobbed hair. And she's 63 kilos, or so her supplement says. Let's just make sure that this is you. I've been fooled before. I apologize. Uh, your numbers seem to match up. Your expiration dates are all in well good order. And, yeah. Let's just go ahead and say you're good to go. Obstron, welcome to Aristotska. Glory. Please no pink things. Thank you. Oh my. That actually looks like a family member of mine. <laughs> that is strikingly similar. I don't think they su they supported the release of this game, but if they did, boy would I be in surprise. Okay, everything seems to match up. Sophia... You're going to be here for three months. Uh, stay a couple of months. Okay, yeah, that makes sense. Uh, 51 kilos, 169 centimeters. Yep, 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 yep. Go ahead. Get on out of here. You're good to go. I'll be really pissed off to find out that that didn't have a... That was a forged working permit. What in... Fuck you! All right. Obstron, what do you got for me? Are those pimples or piercings? I can't tell. Uh, Lauren Brewer, all your numbers seem to match up. You're going to be immigrating forever, and that's exactly what you said on the transcript. Um, 66 kilos, 187, 85 centimeters. Lauren, looks like everything matches up. Ship shape, expiration dates, all in order. Please don't cost me any more money. I'm pretty sure my family's hungry. Today is a bad day. Oh, we got the Antichrist again. Um, Mr. Yeah, if you expect me to pronounce that, you have got another thing coming. Your passport number matches up. Your expiration dates, dates, dates are in good order. Ooh, you're very close on this uh, ID supplement here, good sir. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and say everything looks all right, even though you might not look like that person. I'm not 100% on that. Go ahead and let you on through. Glory. See you later.
No violations, no violations, no violations. Yes. Well, that cost me 10 bucks on the day, <laughs> and I still made $15. That's great. Well, a lot of people are cold, so I'm going to go ahead and put the heat on. Gonna be hungry tomorrow, though. Promise you that. All right, we're gonna go ahead and take a nap. What? What? Government headquarters in Paradisian evacuated. What? What is this? The order seems to be sending me a message. Only possible with Aristotelian expertise. Breakthrough in spinal surgery perfected. Oh well. Well, that must mean something for us. We're not as broke as I thought I was. Well, it was not as broke as we thought we were. However, it's still crazy. That kind of kind of looks like Jason Voorhees. I don't know what to say there. Um, where's the rest of your neck, sir? I think that's really the problem here. Wanted criminals. Is there anything else we need to worry about? No, not really. Just another day in beautiful gray. Uh, uh, All right. Go ahead and take a look. This appears to be Ellen Halvosk, uh, whatever. I, you know, these names, these names. I know some of these names actually came from people who donated for the game during its development. However, I, I, you know, I feel bad. I feel remiss in saying that I cannot, for the life of me, pronounce some of these names, especially under duress. Cause no trouble. Everything looked to be in good shape. I'd be very upset to start off my day with a citation. Good. This is a good sign. Death to Aristotska. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, Jesus, give it back. Why won't you... Oh, shit balls. What do we do? What do we do? What's going on? It. Look! Look! You, you see? Oh, what is this amateur shit? Should we evacuate for that little thing? No, of course not. Just disable it over the counter. Oh, fuck. All right. Take the screws off. All right, first... I'm going to disable this wire, it looks like. What should I do? Could not even add the display. The poorest bomb I ever see. Simple minded this shit. Just cut the wires in order. Okay, so we got uh, you. Uh, you. Three you. And then you. All done. Back to work. <laughs> I feel like we should close the checkpoint. Bullshit. I need to earn money. Give bomb to me. I sell for materials and give you cut. What a piece of shit. <laughs> I doubt it even worth much. Call the next immigrant. <laughs> Well, there you go, back to Earth. Tough, <laughs> tough as nails. Nothing to worry about here. Nothing to see here, folks. Just bullshit bomb making. All right, we got a diplomatic authorization for a one Pablos Devesetri. And your numbers seem to match up. You are, of course, authorized to enter Aristotica. So I'm going to go ahead and say everything looks all right, provided that all your dates match up. And they do. All right, you're good to go. See you later. Glory to Aristotle. Uh, We've seen this guy before. I feel like we have. And every time I see him, I want to say that's not him because of his goddamn... His goddamn mohawk. Uh, mustache. Uh, can I just highlight this? Well, he has, obviously has a mustache. So that's not what I'm... Highlighting. Um, well, you're an engineer, so you get the last one of these. Go ahead. What is this? Uh huh. All right, Justin Dialovsky. Uh, everything else seems to match up. Let's just make sure your passport number's in good shape. You're going to be here one month. Is that what you said? 30 days is consistent with the phrase one month. And it looks like you're good to go. So you took the last of my engineering cards. Congratulations! You are the fifth customer. Glory. I really don't want to let in a criminal. That's that that's kind of what my goal is for today. Don't let in any criminals. All right. So let's just double check. It doesn't look like yeah, you don't match anybody that's even close to that. Uh but you know what? You don't have an ID supplement and that's a problem. Where's your ID supplement? I never got one. Well, you know what you can get? A denied stamp. It's pretty popular these days. The kids love it. Get out of here. Next. All right, we got Essex. Papers, please. Give me the coded documents. Yeah, hey, take them. I didn't like them anyway. Both. Yeah. Let's see. What do you got for me? Only one agent approved. We cannot succeed with your help. Uh, when Aristotle was born, the order... Without your help, sorry. The order fulfilled the same role as today. When tyranny ends, we shall disappear again. Okay. Fine. 
So in order to make them go away, I have to work with them, I guess is what he's saying. All right, we got the woman who looks like she either has high cheekbones or plastic surgery on both sides of her face, and it went awry. 47 kilos, very short hair. Really can't tell with that hat on, but it seems to match anyway. Expiration date is the 9th. That's two days away. She's going to be here for one year due to work. Yep, you stay a year. That's very good. Okay, your picture seems to match. Uh, everything else that you're saying. Roberta Misak, all your numbers and all your dates. Uh, intend to check out, uh, I was pressing the wrong button there. Let's go ahead and just, uh, approve you. Get you on out of here. Go on. You're good. Go engineer something beautiful. Alright, let's see who else we can get through today. Hoping to get up to 15, because that's our only saving grace. If we can get through enough people, I mean, you know. Let's see, map. Let's go to the map real quick. Aristotska. Let's make sure this time... This is one of the issuing cities. Uh, Vel... Vesquilo District? I don't see Vesquilo District. Yeah. Nice try. False information. I do not understand. Well, let me explain it to you. D-E-T-I-A-N. Detain. See ya. Nice try, though. Almost got me. A younger me would have let that go. But I know better. I've only been reprimanded for it 17 times. Uh, let's see. Lahana Neva. She is going to be staying here for Emmer. For Emmer. Forever immigrating, coming to live with her husband. Uh, she's over <laughs> The only description is she's overweight. You could have put glasses. You could have put short hair. You could have put, uh, you know, small part in the front. Uh, overweight. Okay, I see what you're going with there. Uh, you got to be in by the 8th, which is tomorrow. Cool. Better let you in today unless uh, something's wrong. I don't really see a reason to let you in otherwise. But everything seems to match up. So we're going to go ahead and let you in. See you later. Don't make your husband happy. I don't know how, but just do it. All right, papers. Uh, you look like you've been beat a few times. Beat up. <laughs> Punched in the face. Your, your mouth's kind of off to the side there. I don't know. Are you a prize fighter? Is that what you're coming over here for? Uh, let's see. Expiration dates match up. Your passport number does also match up. You have short curly hair. Uh, fingerprint. Really can't do much with that. 59 kilos. Uh, weight. And the height. Okay, everything matches up. Uh, from Glorian. I'm going to go ahead and say that that's all good and well. Get up on out of here. Go. Good for you. 11 people later. And no citations. That, that's a... Fuck! I knew as soon as I said it. As soon as I said it. Well, you know, it's one. It's a collection. All right. You're not a criminal from what I can tell. Uh, Air Bram. Or Bram Airs. Passport number seems to match up. You're going to be visiting for 14 days, two weeks. That's consistent. Um, short cropped hair, 92 kilos uh, from Vetter. And everything seems to match up. So let's go ahead and let you in. Get on to the next possible terrorist. I'd like to greet all of them before I let them into the country. Here we go. No, no, are you? No, you're not. Okay, I thought maybe you could be one of these criminals that we've been looking for. We're going to be here for two days, a couple of days. That's exactly what you just said. I saw the text scroll up. Uh, your numbers seem to match up. Uh, let's see, your name is Karina Wong, and you're a female. I question that. I don't think you're a female. Are you a woman? Is this document says. All right, well, you know, I have this button here that's going to prove you either right or wrong. So let's go ahead and press it. All right, show me female parts. Yep, female parts. All right, well, it was worth checking. Not for my enjoyment, but for my, you know, sanity. All right, get out of here, you. All right, end of the second day. What do we got? Everybody's hungry. Well, that makes sense. Your son is sick and needs medicine. The Ministry of Income has cleared all wrongdoing. Your savings will not be returned. Of course it won't. Because, as you can probably tell, it wasn't my savings to begin with. Um, well, we have $5 in the bank. That's a good sign. Because at least with those $5, we can build on getting our son some, some medicine. Or at least feeding everybody. All right. That'll do it for today's episode of Papers, Please. Next time on Papers, Please, hopefully we help out Essek a little bit more and not screw it up. YouTube, thanks for showing up. We'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.